Miranda Lambert, one of the sweetest voices in country music, but you know she can also be sassy and cause some problems when she wants to. This is her song, Tin Man. I'm looking forward to it. Let's take a listen. Hello and welcome. This is a Miranda Lambert song, and Miranda Lambert is one of my favorite female country artists. As far as modern country artists putting music out now, I would put Miranda Lambert, Carly Pierce, and Ray Lynn in my top three. I love every one of their voices and the songs that they put out. I've heard this song before, but I don't know if I've paid attention to it. And so this time I'm going to listen to it and pay attention to it and really get into the feel of it and the lyrics of it. I'm looking forward to it. Let's go. But if you, if you haven't yet, please like and subscribe. That helps the channel so much. It just helps YouTube show the videos more, which gets us more people, which makes me want to make more videos. Make sense? So if you haven't, please like and subscribe. All right, here we go. There was a video for her singing this at the ACMs, I think, in 2017. Hey there, Mr. Tinman. You don't know how lucky you are. No heart. You shouldn't spend your whole life wishing. Mm. I see where it's going. For something bound to fall apart. Wow. It's good. Every time you're feeling empty, better thank your lucky star. I'm gonna tell you right now, I've already got goosebumps. I got goosebumps. If you ever felt mm, weak, Lord have mercy. You never want to hurt. Goodness gracious. I've been on the road that you're on. Yeah. Yeah. It didn't get me very far. Heartbreak. You ain't missing nothing. This love is so damn hard. Yeah, it is. Yep. Yep. Take it from me, darling. That's great, y'all. That's great. Oh, the writing in this is incredible. It's in pieces now. The idea and the writing and the words and the literature are spot on. By the way there, Mr. Tin Man. If you don't mind the scars, you give me your armor. Hmm. You can have my heart.
writers Miranda Lambert and Jack Ingram. Oh my goodness. Wow. That was amazing, y'all. When they talk about songwriting, done a little, a little, I've dabbled in it. They always say, show, don't tell. Don't tell about the heartbreak. Don't use words that describe the heartbreak. Basically show a visual, a feeling, a story, something so that everybody knows exactly what you're talking about without you actually using those words. I forget what the first lyrics were. Hey, Mr. Tin Man, you don't know how lucky you are? Boom. Right then, you knew this is a heartbreak song. Just from... The and you also knew where she stood in the song. You knew that she had had her heart broken because she says you don't know how lucky you are. The fact of... You don't want... You, you, you don't want this. You don't want this heartbreak. It's a very, it's a very interesting thing about human emotions in humans nothing can make you healthier and happier than sharing your life with somebody you love giving your heart to them but at the same time nothing can destroy you faster than an unhealthy relationship or a relationship that you wanted to work out break up and that's what this song is about just the, the intense heartbreak of i give up it's an i give up song you can feel the desperation in the lyrics. Maybe not desperation, probably the wrong word. The sadness and just the fact that I'm done because I've done all I can. Let's go look at this. Um, Randa Lambert. I guess it came out in 2017. I have a feeling, I, I want to say I've seen this and I may have seen it when I was about to prepare this video that I think it made it up to like number 15 on the charts. Yeah, number 15, number 22, depends on which chart you're looking at. Number 22, which is not per se a radio song. If you notice, it didn't really have a chorus. It was three verses. Uh, so it's not, and it's certainly not a toe tapper. So I can understand it having some trouble getting some radio play. And that's one thing Miranda Lambert, that's one thing she's sticking to. She's writing and singing her songs, even though the radio execs aren't promoting her music as much. And you'll notice her radio play is less and less. She doesn't have the number ones that she used to. And even throughout her career, she has just put out the music she wanted to put out and let it land where it, wanted to, where it was going to land. And you've got to appreciate that about an artist. Some artists are going to do whatever they can do to get a number one. And that's just whatever they're going to put out. But Miranda puts out the music she wants to put out. And I'm very glad that she wrote this song. I'm very glad that I heard it again today. And I'll have to remember this song. I'm sure I heard it before, but paying attention to it, wow, that was just a totally different level. Great. Absolutely wonderful. Love Miranda Lambert's music. Hey, thanks for staying this long. If you're still here, please like and subscribe. And if you want to check out our Patreon link in the video description below, that would be helpful as well. Until next time, I'm looking forward to doing more music. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.